My name is Elizabeth Eckford. My name is Mary James. I live in Little Rock with my mother, father, and six siblings. I live in Little Rock with my mother and father. Today is September 4th, 1957, and I get to go to an all-white school with eight other kids. Today, black kids will be joining our school. Last time they tried this, the National Guard stopped it. Last time people tried to have blacks in our school, the National Guard stopped it. They should do it again. I'm glad President Eisenhower is going to not let the National Guard stop it this time. President, President Eisenhower should stop this. I'm very nervous and excited. I'm extremely upset. Hopefully kids will accept me. No one will accept this. At least I'm not alone in this. They shouldn't be coming to this school. Everyone was staring and making fun of me when I was walking into the building. I was laughing at the new kids coming to our school. I got picked for this because I'm brave, but their words still hurt and I cried in the bathroom. It was the funniest thing today. No one wanted to sit with me for any of my classes. I had some classes with a black girl. No one sat with her. It was funny. I didn't think this day could get any worse. I didn't think this day could get any worse. I was ready to go home. I can't wait to tell my family how today was. As I was walking away from the school, a girl stopped me. I stopped this black girl today. She told me it was a disgrace to be black. I told her she shouldn't be at all at an all-white school. I told her I'm, the, I'm perfect the way I am. She said she was perfect. There is no way that is true. She laughed and I cried. She cried. I started to walk away. She started to walk away. I didn't let her. She grabbed my arm. I told her, watch her back. I told her to stay away. I tried to ignore her. She looked away while I like, glared at her. I started to walk home. Hopefully she doesn't come back. When I was out of sight, I cried and ran home. Why do I need to put blacks in their place? She ruined any chance I had to feel normal. I told my family what happened today, but I just, left per parts out. I told my family what happened today, but left out how I got bullied. I hate how the U.S. is letting them come to our school. It has been a year since my first day at Central High, and every day someone says something about my race.